about how we can advocate for health issues. First one on my list is to understand your body. What do I mean by that? It's simply just being able to recognize what is normal and what is not. And sometimes it, it can take some time. It can take listening to other people. It can take listening to health professionals. Let's take an example of menstrual cycle or menstrual periods. Uh, one of the things I learned quite early on myself was keeping track of my periods and just learning to make notes of symptoms or th things that I was concerned about if and when they happened because I found that writing them down helps in terms of just keeping track you remember when it happened what context it was happening in what was this situation what kind of stress was that were you going through and so understanding your body means that you are aware of how your breasts feel because you do regular breast examinations every month you are aware of how your periods are regular you are aware if you have a 28 day cycle or if you have a 35 day cycle something in between or something longer so if you keep track you can do that using a simple calendar a diary using apps that are very popular now but you're keeping track of this information so that if something happens that is not within your usual pattern you can bring it to the attention of your healthcare providers quickly and also schedule regular checkups with your um, doctors your general practitioners or your specialist gynecologists as needed and um, i think it's important especially as we're growing older women going past the age of 20s um, in the uk we start cervical screening from the age of 25 so you start to get your regular invitation from the age of 25 making sure that you don't miss those appointments because they're important to quickly or to identify early any changes that might be associated with cervical cancer uh, but it's not just cervical screening um, it's also things like i've just mentioned making sure you're examining your breasts regularly and if you feel something is not normal or you feel something seems out of the ordinary come and sit down with your doctor and have a chat about it um, older women there are well women checks for example after the age of 40 you can go in and have a chat with the healthcare providers have some blood tests so we're looking at things like your blood pressure looking at things like the weight cholesterol level and all these things which that's an important time to begin to keep track of them because you want to make sure the risks of disease like um, heart problems diabetes and so on are reduced and the other thing is if you have a family history of certain conditions then you might want to get in touch with your doctor early be able to discuss what things should i be looking out for what things should i be concerned about because we've got this family history in my family so that's understand your body <laughs>